The Minister of Agriculture and Food Security, Senator Abubakar Kiari, has assured of timely delivery of the yearly 2,000 tractors to aid dry season farming and address the challenge of food insecurity. The minister gave the assurance during a technical meeting on mechanization with a contracted company, John Deere Group, on Wednesday in Abuja. He said, although there has been some delays in the whole process, the federal government is not resting on its oars. The minister was joined by his colleague, Minister of State for Agriculture and Food Security, Senator Sabi Abdullahi. And what I'm saying is that we need to just ramp up and speed up our, our program so that we, we achieve the 2000 by the end of the year. I think that's what it is. This is the right step in the right direction. The federal government, under the leadership of President Ahmed Bola Junhu, had decided that this time this should work. And we have never gotten to this stage before. But here we are, we want to even exceed. And I'm here as Minister of Agriculture and Food Security, even complaining that we are behind time. Check us maybe in the next uh, three, four months and then find out what we're doing. I've already mentioned that we need timelines and we need to do uh, 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 monitoring and evaluation of our positions as time goes on. And I'm happy. What we are having is a total package. This is the difference, and that is the game changer. Because when there are no technical people who will attend to this, farmers misuse it. They bring people who try to, you know, provide, uh, is it improvise, and in the course of it, damage the mechanism that the machinery is supposed to work with. We've had several rehabilitation of tractors in the past. It never worked. So I think this time around, the right thing is being done. Here we are, the managing director of John Deere, Stefan Goes, said partnership with Nigeria goes beyond provision of the tractors. It covers full farming mechanization involving training and entrepreneur. Major thing that we want to do is increase the profitability of the of the farmer. It, it can be the small guy, the small farmer, it can be the large commercial farmer. The goal of this is to increase the prof profitability of this. And then the last one is, is for bringing the technology, but also the training. It's not a, a, a solution that we want to sell the tractor and we want to be out to make a quick buck. We're in it for the long term. We want to build the community. We've got thousands of these projects running elsewhere in, in, um, in, in Africa. It's a bigger scheme. It's a, it's a longer, um, longer project that we are working on. And we are really, really excited. We know this is going to work. Um, we just need to cross the, the last couple of hurdles. The federal government had in 2023 signed a memorandum of understanding with John Deere Group on agricultural mechanization targeting the provision of 2,000 tractors yearly for five years.